What's up guys, this is Josh back here from Inside Wrestling Truth, back with another video today. Um, today's video is a DVD review, one that I've been wanting to do for like a month now, I just haven't got around to doing it. Um, it's this Paul Heyman, uh, let's see there, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Heyman, the Blu-ray. Uh, this DVD it's kick ass man uh let's pop it open here there's the two discs as you can see um it's very good i mean the dock on it is killer uh it's like two and a half two and a half hours long um this okay i'm gonna go through a little bit of the uh dock just to let you guys know what's on it uh, they haven't picked it up. A lot of you guys already have it, but the ones I haven't, go get it. Because uh, to me, it's the best WWE DVD of the year so far. Uh, we can go into the doc first, though. Uh, we have Sur we have Survivor, uh, phot Photographer, Promoter, Manager, Memphis, AWA, WCW, ECW, Team Mentality, Rebels, Commentator, Writer, uh, talk OVW, new ECW, businessman, father, return to WWE, and embracing the moment. Like I said, this doc is awesome. Um, damn near everything you want to know about Paul Heyman is in here. Um, then we have tons and tons of promos. We start off in the AWA. We have... Paul Lee is always in contact from AWA, August 87. From August 87, we have Pink Suspenders. August 87, we have I'll Be Johnny Carson. Uh, from September 87, we have Danger Zone with Teddy Bear. The Danger Zone was kind of like a uh, low-budget Piper Pit deal. Um, from September 87, You Want to Be a Cartoon. Uh, September 87, if excitement had a name, more, publi more publicity from September 87, Adrian Adonis in October 87, and the definition of pro wrestling from November 87. That wraps up the promos from the AWA. Um, now we're going to go to the WCW. Uh, we have the sequel with Jim Cornette. Uh, Nobody wanted Paul Lee from November 88. Louisville Slugger, defense of December 88. Um, the Louisville Slugger was also like a little uh, talk show that Jim Cornette had. Uh, the Year of Paul Lee Dangerously from January 89. Danger Zone with Ric Flair. I'm so handsome. I don't have wrestlers. I have animals. Ding Dong, who is it? The Era of the Dangerous Alliance. Uh, Sting's Doll. Where he has Sting's fit action figure, and he's like beating the shit out of it with his big ass cell phone. And Sting runs in, save us from Captain Oklahoma, the Dangerous Alliance, the Paul Lee Awards, the Ultimatum is at hand. I mean, just a lot, a lot of promos. We go to ECW. We have a a new Dangerous Alliance. WW, WCW wants Sabu, wrestler and violence. Winds of Change, Best Damn Wrestling I've Ever Seen, Cash Rules Everything, There Ain't No Organization Like ECW, ECW Comes to Pay-Per-View, The Week, Week Clear, Cable Vision, The Card Has Changed, The War Has Just Begun, these are all promos that are on the first disc along with the doc if you have the Blu-ray, um, I bought the Blu-ray because uh, the Blu-ray at Best Buy was as much as the standard DVD, and if, if I'm going to have to pick one, I'm definitely going to pick up the Blu-ray. I ain't taking nothing away from the standard DVD. Go get it. But uh, the same price, I'm going to get the Blu-ray. It's just me, though. Uh, stories. We have photo of Vince Sr. and Andre riding in Freddie Blassie's car. Troubles in Memphis. The Mo. Borrowing time, conference call, Paul Heyman guy. These are all stories that wasn't in the doc that he talks about. Uh, we have teasers, the real story of the PG era. Statue of limitations, in your face, the more extreme. Then we go to disc two. Um, 
This is a lot of this is a lot of newer stuff on this too. We have Paul Heyman hates Mr. McMahon's Intru introducing the next big thing. Uh, Paul Heyman, Mr. McMahon, and Eric Bischoff all share one ring. Paul Heyman thanks to ECW faithful the resurrection of ECW from the bingo hall to the garden. Mr. McMahon gives Paul Heyman a performance review. Paul Heyman gives CM Punk his resignation. It's clobbering time for CM Punk. Volcano. Paul Heyman drops a pipe bomb. Uh, then we go into some matches, rare matches that you may not have seen. Uh, we have the original Midnight Express versus the new Midnight Express. Um, we have Hardy Boys versus Brock Lesnar and Paul Heyman. And then we have a no DQ handicap match from, a year, from last year. CM Punk versus Curtis Axel and Paul Heyman. Now, this is all on the standard DVD, but this is when it gets good on the Blu-ray. We have Blu-ray exclusives, and a ton of them at that. Uh, we have Riding a Bike Down a Rooftop, Lending a Hand, Manager Fan Clubs, Austin, Austin Idols Manager, Cell Phone, New York, I Own My Career to Paul Heyman, Micromanaging, Needed Venting, Paul the Promo Guy, Mystery Partner, Program Money, Leather Bag, Sending ECW Tape, No Show, Grossman, King of New York City, White Corvette, Supported by the Competition. Ended up with nothing. Torn in the ECW arena, Out with a Bang, Common Bond, Breaking Vince's Desk, Baseball Slide, Creative Paul, King Kong, Because I Can't, Dirty Laundry, Real Friends, Comical Paul, Kids Cutting Promos, Heroes, Genius or Insane, Genuine Friend. Conqueror of the Streak. This DVD is just badass. If you haven't yet, whether you get the Blu-ray or you get the regular DVD, let me tell you guys something. It's worth it. It's a very good DVD. Like I said, uh, in my opinion, it's the best DVD of this year. Uh, it's one of the most. Lo it's a, one of the longer docs that they ever did, and they really, really spent uh, a good t detail of time putting uh, work in on this uh, DVD here. Um, like I said, there's the front. There's the back. Uh, the Blu-ray is eight hours. Uh, tons of extras. So, I've did DVDs before, but in my opinion, this one right here, this Paul Heyman, is a must-buy. Go pick it up. If you see it somewhere, go grab it. Uh, it's one that, you, that you're really going to want for your collection. Um, yeah, this is the Paul Heyman uh, DVD. I'm not going to do a review on the Sting. Uh... But I just figured I'd do a review on this Paul Heyman DVD. It'd probably be a while before I do another WWE review. Because I don't buy WWE DVDs like I used to. I mainly buy like from Kayfabe and High Spots and Art Video. But uh, this has just been a DVD review of My Name is Paul Heyman uh, DVD. Love this DVD. Go pick it out. Thanks for all of my subs. I really appreciate it. Um, I figured I'd come on and do this after I watched the Steelers just look horrible against Tampa. Uh, I have my week four Steelers video coming up soon, so be on the lookout for that. And thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And peace, everybody.